The whole concept of uh, doing the dedication of Solomon's Temple was Ron Cannoli's. When Don Moen had asked me, have you got any ideas for your next recording? And, uh, and I shared, yeah, yeah, I, I, want to, I want to do an album of dedication. What we're here to do in this album is to proclaim that our God is a good God. When he has his goodness proclaimed back to him, his presence comes. For Solomon's time, all they knew was the sacrifices of bulls and goats and building a temple made of stone versus today, uh, you know, in the New Testament, we're the temple. When the singers and musicians were as one voice and they gave thanks to the Lord saying he is good and his mercy endures forever that the house of the Lord is filled with a cloud so that the priests could not continue to stand and minister because of the cloud. To be able to reproduce or recreate this for the purpose of reaching millions of people in the world today, it's a privilege beyond description. The whole point of coming together here in Florida on this particular date is to bring the best sacrifices that we have to offer. That's what we're going to be saying tonight in this reenactment of the dedication of the temple. It is also a dedication of these temples. Tonight's service will be a reenactment, a partial reenactment of the dedication of that temple that Solomon built. And of course, we know that the temple represents a place where the presence of God could rest. And of course, the ark represented the presence of God. First Peter 2.5 says that we are all living stones fitted together in the house of the Lord. We are the temple of God tonight. Romans 12, 1 also says for us to present ourselves as living sacrifices. We know that as the temple was dedicated and as the sacrifices were presented before the Lord, the Lord himself came down and consumed the sacrifices. We offer ourselves as living sacrifices. And we invite the Lord to come and ignite us tonight like he ignited the sacrifices. Hallelujah. Set us on fire, Lord, so the world can, can watch us burn for you. Glory to God.